Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Princess Renny here, and I hope you're doing well. On this channel, we talk about Christian faith, lifestyle, as well as natural hair. If you're interested in any of those things, make sure that you keep watching because we have a treat for you guys today. <music> So as many of you guys know, I've had these locks in my hair for the past four months. Yes, four months. I had two touch-ups and now it's getting to that time where I'm going to end up taking it out. But before I do, I decided I'm going to show you guys a few different hairstyles that you can do with your locks, whether it's new or old. Um, so yeah, I'm excited because I have so many different hairstyles that I... I don't even know how many they are. So yeah, let's get right into it. The first one can be this little center part. You put all the hair down, you know, and just like this. And this is your first hairstyle. That's it. You can put it all in the front. You can put it all in the back. You can put a few in front and a few in the back, whatever you prefer. But yeah, this is the first hairstyle that's center part. You do kind of like, the flip overs we call it or a side part like take your time and do it and actually create a side part so this is hairstyle number two you can also do a low ponytail with this so what i like to do i leave it at the side part so then i would get the hair on the sides in the back and i would just keep wrapping it kind of like tying it around itself My necklace for a second. Oh, yeah, you just keep wrapping it around until you can tie it in the back and underneath. So, is this green? And this is your little ponytail. You could also use an actual scrunchie, but I like to use a lot because it's just easier. It's faster. Straight to hairstyle number three. Hairstyle number four is when you take out, you can actually take some of these out and create kind of like a Bang style. You see that? You see that? Look at that. It's so cute. I just want to end it here. That is so cute. Okay. Um, but I'm gonna keep going. <laughs> I can't believe I've never done these hairstyles. Like, I've been slacking. It's making me kind of want to keep this in for like another week. Should I do it? Let me know. Yeah, I think I should keep it in for another week. Like, look at it. That's a cute hairstyle. But the next hairstyle is when I do, this is actually one of my favorites. I like to do it with or without a bang. So we can tie this in the back first. So we go back to the center part. This is like where I start off because then I can get the hair that I need. But first, we can start off with the tendrils. And then we gather like half of our hair. Or as close to half as possible. And then, it's gonna take one of the strands that's in the back that's not the of it. Cause that's just gonna make it easier. You're gonna grab it with your pinky. And then we're just gonna go, take your pinky still. See the hair still in my pinky. And I'm pulling it all the way. You see that? The hair is still in my pinky. Wait, I pulled it, let go of it because my index finger and thumb have it. And then I'm just going to keep guiding the hair until it's wrapped completely around. And once it's wrapped completely around, you can either let it just fall naturally back like that. Or sometimes I like to separate it like this. And this your little half up, half down with those tendrils. Yeah, I need to get my life. <laughs> my phone's always dying. But yeah, you could do it like that. Or if you want to get rid of the tendrils altogether, you don't want it. And like maybe you changed your mind and you already have the hairstyle. I sometimes take these, the tendrils, and I would just wrap it around the hair. As if it was never part of it. Even as fast, you know, you could just freestyle. It doesn't have to be perfect. Take the other one, do the same thing in the opposite direction. And this is how you make it this week. And make sure that you kind of wrap it over the hair to make it seem like it was perfect. Looking like that. Just start off with doing this. 
And then again, my favorite, separating the two. Just like that. You can also do a half bun on top. So just go ahead and wrap it all the way around. Like this. Oops. Take your time. Getting a little too excited. So yeah, just wrap it around. How could you? It's finally perfect. It's gonna have its own little brain of its own, but you see it. You can leave it here in the back, or you can put it, split it in the middle and bring it to the front. Do whatever you prefer, whatever you like. But separate it. Yep, those tendrils are very important. So you don't have the tendrils, but still keeping your hair split in a half pop down style. This time, instead of having one half a pop down, we need to do two. So again, taking the furthest one in the back, just wrap it around, and you have one pigtail. Actually, wore my hair like this the other day, and the kids love it. It's so cute. Take the first pigtail. Boom. This one. Give them a little bag. And if you don't like it with the, the tendrils, you can always get rid of it as you guessed. Just wrap it around itself till it hides completely as if it was never part of it in the first place. Try to put it more under than over because you don't want it to be like this big bulky thing wrapped around so little much hair. But you know, plan out your hairstyle accordingly. Or you can do the two buns, two chop buns, the half a half bun. How stinking cute is this? I've never worn my hair like this, but look at that. That's so cute. It's my style it exactly how I need it falling. So, yeah. And as always, I kind of bring it to the front if you can't really see the hair, like the length. I kind of bring some to the front or all to the front. But yeah, I lost track of how many hairstyles this is, so I'm just gonna keep going. Okay, I'm just gonna keep going. Make sure to follow where the tendril is. And then just do the bun with it, with this hair. Mixing it up to flow. It's never gonna be perfect. You're never gonna have two buns that are like exactly identical, just like your eyebrows. You're gonna be exactly, exactly the same. But yeah, this is the other hairstyle. Oh my gosh, this one's cute too. This makes it so hard. You're gonna flip this and put the, the vein here, but then you're also gonna take the rest and kind of tie it. Does that make sense? You're going to tie it in the back onto each other. Kind of like that. Not going to be perfect. Not be perfect, but you know, you have some hair coming to the side, some hair in the back. Whatever you prefer, you can bring it all of it forward. If you'd like, let's do another hair shot. Hiya! Two pigtails with the hair. With the side, oops. This is one pigtail, like that, and then do this and do the other one. Again, it's just a matter of like a wrapping it around itself. So I still have my side suit, but then I have my hair in two pigtails in the back. And so this is what it looks like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Together. Now, Almost done, guys. Almost done. We're gonna take our hair side up in the center part. I'm just gonna kind of like wrap it with a couple of hairs in the back. I'm gonna tie it in the back so I can see myself. 
It's a struggle, okay? So I'm gonna kind of turn and <laughs> kind of tie it to the side and then adjust accordingly so it falls in the back. Does that make sense? Yeah, so I pull more on one side so it goes exactly like this one. Boom. Boom. So that's in the back, just so it lays a bit more flat. Uh, let me actually try that. Just use less hair. So I So if your edges are not done, if your edges are not done, you just do you just put a little something there and you're done, you're out the door, you're good to go. No one has to know that your hair is not 100% done and you're good to go. Let's say I decided I was gonna do flip over, right? I could do it with the hairs on the side, so I'll take two and guide it towards the back of the hair. Notice that everything else is in the front, so it's gonna go to the back, and then take these two and do the same thing on the other side. Everything else is in the front, so the only hairs in the back are the ones. Together, and then so now with this fall on top of it, and you never have to worry about you losing your side parts now because it's tied together. So your hair is gonna go where it wants to go, but this part right here is gonna stay. You just gotta fix the back of it. Oh, I didn't show you guys the bun. So this is the bun. You put all the hair towards the front, and you just grab the hair. Just a little bit. This first, this is the ponytail. It's hard to do a ponytail with all this hair, I'm gonna be honest. I can never get it right, but yeah. You do that and then you try to find the ends of the hair when you want to do the bun because the ends of the hair is going to help you kind of find it. How you want that to fall, how you want it to look. So get the ends and just start twisting. It's okay if you miss some hairs because they're eventually going to make their way in the cut when you go around the side. So boom, boom, boom. And voila, we have a bird's nest on our head. Come on, birds. Come rest on this nest. <laughs> so that's that. And then I think my go-to hairstyle for today is going to be the tendrils and an elevated ponytail. It's not gonna be low, it's not gonna be high, it's gonna be elevated. So I'm gonna try to take a strand somewhere over here and just kind of wrap it around and lift my hair. Because again, we're going to elevate it, but it's not going to be super high. Especially because it's all this hair, it's not going to end up being super high. So, this is what we're going for. Alright, just keep going. Do -do 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 -do. Just like this over here. And that's it. That is the last and final look. Oh, I was thinking cute. I hope you enjoyed this video on all the different hairstyles you can do with your locks, whether it's new or old. If you like it, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Also make sure that you're subscribed to the channel and click on the bell button so you're always notified whenever I post a new video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Be blessed, spread love, and stay beautiful inside and out. Bye, guys. Yeah. Okay, this is what we go with. All right, I like this. I like this hairstyle. I like it. <laughs>